Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Hex, and this is Transformers Masterpiece MP18S Silver Streak. Now, out of all the Datsun slash Nissan, whatever you want to call it, basically the Streak mold, uh, this is probably the one that I have the least interest in. It wasn't until I decided that I wanted to collect all the Masterpiece figures and all their different repaints. It doesn't matter if they come out with some bizarre thing, uh, you know, brown and orange, you know, I'll buy that too. So it really doesn't matter whenever it comes to me collecting Masterpiece. But for you, uh, maybe this video helps you out. Maybe it's something that you're like, yes, I definitely want to have that because you got the commemorative series Silver Streak. Uh, then, you know, I guess it would be kind of cool to have. But to me, it's not a must have. But let's go ahead and take a look at what all it comes with. It does come with these missile quadrants right here. It also comes with a gun. Now, just like I showed off in Blue Blue Streaks review, you can plug it here into the side. The other one over here. And you can, oh, I've already done it, but you can push this gun down like that. You can pop this open and there's a little thing that you can swing out and plug the gun up top. So if you want some kind of Mad Max looking vehicle, then you can do that. It also comes with a collector's coin. Now there's no you know, choice there whether you want one with or without a coin. Uh, it just automatically comes with it just like Blue Streak or Blue Blue Streak does. So me, I, I don't collect those. I don't care about them. But if they're going to throw it in for free, then whatever. But let's go ahead and take a look at the vehicle itself. Uh, let's see if there's any like damages or like any blemishes or anything like that on mine. Uh, I don't see any. I've kind of looked it over before I started the review, but uh, yeah, this is the fifth time I've owned this mold. So I'm pretty familiar with it. Uh, it does look like the, uh, I might've not even, might've not transformed it properly, but it looks like this door is, you can kind of see how this one is flush, but this one's kind of, Showing a little bit of red. So whenever we do the transformation, we're going to go from car to robot and back to car. So maybe it's something that ends up fixing itself, but uh, who knows. You got the smoked out windows. Everything looks nice. It's kind of hard to mess this up considering that it's all one color. But that rolls just fine. Let's go ahead and get into the transformation. Just like all the others, you're going to pull down with this section here. And then you're going to pop that which will let you grab here and then you can pop the doors because they are plugged in right there and then what we're going to do is come with our finger and get the head out then pop that and we can get these mirrors in there i just did the uh the blue blue streak review so that's why it's i figured i'd do them both because i hadn't done them yet so make it a little easier since the transformation is fresh in my memory but owning owning so many of these molds you think i'd kind of just have it down already and move those up and you can come down with that section there i'm just gonna leave the doors and the arms there for right now then with uh this section right here I'm going to I just have trouble getting these out. I don't have any fingernails. Yeah, there we go. Pulling those out, separate the legs. Maybe if I would have separated first, it would have been a little bit easier. But I'm going to grab right here because there's a tab in there. You can see that. And then we're going to just start rotating this down. And just like I showed off before, there are two joints. It's swinging on in there, and you're going to swing this up. So while you're coming down with this, swing this up. And then push that little thing up there. And then you can come out with the leg. Go ahead and pull this black thing out, which is going to be the hill spur. Tuck that in, and then fold the window in. And we're going to do the same on this one as well. So... Pop that out and just start swinging it out. Pull that little silver thing up. Come down with that foot. Come out with the leg. Pull the black thing out. Make a hill spur. Close that up. Close that in. Then rotate here at the waist. And then we can you know, fix the, the shoulders how we like them. Kind of tuck them up in there. And then you can come up with the doors. And again, you can leave them like this or you can put them back. Uh, I'll probably just kind of leave his like this 
just because I showed earlier that like I put his all the way back. I mean, when you start getting four or five of these molds, you, you got to start doing something a little bit different so they look, you know, not exactly the same on your shelf. Uh, so that's kind of what I decided to do. Now, as far as what do they use for this mold, it is the Blue Streak mold. So like I showed in the Blue Blue Streak review that they use the Prowl mold, you know, minus the uh, siren or whatever. So you see the head's exactly the same and the waist is exactly the same, which are the differences there. Oh, and uh, pull these little things out. Go ahead and connect that back on there. And push this in and down. Do the same thing with this one. And you can position those however you want. Give him his little gun here and And there he is. I, you know, I, I'm glad I have him. Uh, but if I didn't collect all the Masterpiece figures and all the different repaints, then honestly, I probably wouldn't have bought him. Unless he was on sale. You know, so. Give you guys a little 360 so you can see everything. And I, I do like this mold a lot. And I like how it's, you know... Very reminiscent of, you know, the G1 to where, you know, these were his feet and that's the way they did it on here. So that's something I like. It would have been cool if it would have came with like some more paint apps, like you've got the stickers here, but it's, it's whatever, man. All right, so let's take a look at the articulation. Uh, I'll go ahead and pop these off. Same as all the others, uh, the head does rotate a uh, little bit, or actually, he man, he goes up and down all, all, quite a bit. Was I just not moving his very, no? I mean, so yeah, this head works a lot better. That's awesome. Uh, the shoulders, they rotate here. Uh, the tire does kind of hit the back a little bit, so you just kind of got to make sure you move it out of the way a little bit uh does go in and out he does rotate here at the bicep and also has you know nice double jointed elbows does rotate at the wrist and his hand is just a clamp so all the fingers go together and the thumb just stays in one place the waist does rotate all the way around these side skirts they go up and down so if you want to put them in crazy poses or whatever you do with your transformers then uh, you're able to do that he can go forward back out he does rotate here at the thigh bends 90 degrees at the knee and his foot can go front and back and it also has kind of weird ankle pivot where i don't know how much you would consider that ankle pivot but he's got a little bit so all right let's get back into the uh you know car mode I, I do quite like this mold. It's a good thing, too, if I was going to buy five of them. But All right. First thing we're going to do, just kind of straighten them up here, is the legs. So first off, we need to rotate here at the waist. And we're going to pull this back. We're going to come out with that. Not with that, and then collapse the knee. There we go. And then you can start, make sure you push this little silver thing down, and then you can start coming up, and sliding this up here. little silver thing it gets caught all the time and there's that peg up there so just make sure you peg that in and we'll adjust the mirrors afterwards we'll go ahead and slide that down do the same thing with this come out with that pull the black thing in pull this out and collapse the leg and then we can start swinging 
push that little silver thing down. It'll probably get in the way again. And then make sure that's connected. There we go. And then you can pull down with this and connect the legs. Probably have to adjust these little side windows over here. Because you want them pushed all the, all the way up. And the side skirts, you want them flat. Alright, now for the next part, go ahead and pull these doors down. And keep them straight out, just like so. This section, we're going to pull back and get this center part out. And come back with these. And we're going to come down with the arms and get those out of the way. The same thing here. Out of the way. And then we can get these mirrors. And you want to make sure the doors are straight out. Otherwise, like if you don't, they're going to get caught on this side piece here. So just make sure your doors are straight out. And then you can fold the mirrors out. And again, I'm having trouble getting... Oh, there we go. So this one went a little bit easier. And you can fold the head down. And like this. And right there. These little missile things. You need to uh, kind of line up to where... Like if they were the passenger and driver seat. So right up underneath there. the windows are up then we can close the door and with this section here just make sure the tires out and bring this around you got that peg right there move that tire around and you got that slot right there plug those together and you can start coming down so you can get them both in there and might need to just kind of tab everything back together and looks like we you know still it still got a little bit of a problem there so there's it, it's it's minor but like th this side's fine you know you don't really even notice it looking on but it, you know, it's my figure, so, and you pay money for it, you expect no defects whatsoever, but every once in a while you get them, so, just wanted to show it off and let you guys see what it all comes with and uh, the transformation and everything like that, so hopefully you guys enjoyed, talk to you guys later, peace.